Hello everyone and welcome back to the breakdown today. I'm going to be teaching you how to download and install Optifine in Minecraft 1.14.2. Optifine literally came out the day I'm recording this video for 1.14.2. As you can see, it was for uh, came out for 1.14.1 a little while back and we did a uh, video on that, but it has now updated for 1.14.2. We're going to be walking you through every single step of getting Optifine in Minecraft 1.14.2. First and foremost, though, we do have a message from our sponsor, which is Apex Minecraft Hosting. Go to the first link down below the breakdown to the XYZ slash Apex get an incredible 24-hour DDoS protected Minecraft server for you and your friends. We actually love Apex so much that we host our own server on them, play.breakdowncraft.com. So if you are looking for an incredible Minecraft server, Apex Minecraft hosting is the only place to get it. Again, that is the first link down below the breakdown.xyz slash Apex. Nevertheless, let's go ahead and jump right on into this. The first thing you want to do to get Optifine is go to the second link down below, and that's going to take you here. This is actually our in-depth tutorial on installing Optifine, so if we go a little too fast here, or something like that. Just come through this tutorial yourself and it'll walk you all through it. However, I'm going to walk you through everything in this video. First and foremost, you need to click the download Optifine button here on this page and it will take you off to Optifine's official download page. Now, you might be like, Nick, there is no 114.2. There's only 113.2. I'm gone. Bye. Wait! It's out, I promise. All you need to do is click on preview versions right here. And then you'll see Optifine 1.14.2. Now, with that being said, if you have Minecraft 1.14.2 down here, this didn't say 1.13 and it said 1.14.2, you need to download it from down here by clicking on the mirror link right there. However, when this video first came out, you need to click on preview versions and then you'll see Optifine 1.14.2 right there, right? Optifine 1.14.2, come over here and click the mirror button next to 1.14.2. Again, if it is out, go down to the bottom and do it. Otherwise, you need to click preview versions. Now, once you're on this page, you'll see this download Optifine link right here in the center of the screen. It might not start with preview. Obviously, if Optifine's already out and you were able to download it from that main page, then guess what? you wouldn't have preview. Otherwise, it will say Optifine, it will say 1.14.2, and it will end in .jar. Go ahead and click on that link right there, and in the bottom left, it will start to download if you're on Google Chrome. If you're on Mozilla Firefox, it's pulled a pop-up in the center of your screen. You want to go ahead and save file there, and again, as long as this starts with Optifine or preview and ends in .jar, which ours does, we can go ahead and click keep to save the file. And on Mozilla Firefox, again, you're going to click Save File in the center of your screen. Now, if we go ahead and minimize our browser here on our desktop, we have Preview Optifine. This is what we're going to need to basically install Optifine and do everything we're going to do today. If this isn't on your desktop, what you want to do is click the little Windows icon. It's in the top left for me, but it's in the bottom left of your screen. That little Windows icon in the bottom left of your screen. Click on that and then type in Downloads, right like so. You then have this Downloads file folder in Windows. Click on that and you will find Optifine here in this downloads folder drag it to your desktop just for ease of use once it's on your desktop you should be able to right click on it click on open with and then click on java tm platform se binary if you don't have java tm platform se binary or if you click on it and it doesn't work no worries we have a solution for you go to the description of this video and you'll find this this is downloading Java, specifically the Java development kit, which is needed not only in order to run Optifine, but in order to run other Minecraft mods like Forge, as well as run a Minecraft server. All of that requires the Java development kit, and this is our in-depth guide to downloading and installing it. Once you've got that downloaded and installed, if it still doesn't work, you still can't open Optifine, you need to run the jar fix, which is also linked down below. This is very simple. You just go down below and basically download a program, run it real quick, and it fixes all the jar files on your computer. Now, if we go ahead and minimize our browser, we can again right-click on Optifine, click on Open With, and then click on Java TM Platform SE Binary. It will then open up the Optifine installer where we just want to click that install button. It will now go through and automatically install. As you can see, Optifine is successfully installed. If it doesn't install, all you need to do is play Minecraft 1.14.2 and you'll be good to go. So go play Minecraft 1.14.2, you'll be good to go, vanilla, no mods installed and then come back and you'll be able to install Optifine. Nevertheless, we can go ahead and click OK. And at this point, we need to open up the Minecraft Launcher. Now, there is something special we need to do in the Minecraft Launcher. If you just smack the play button, it's not going to work. Let me go ahead and center this on the screen here. So once you're in here, if you just come down here and smack the play button, it's probably not going to work. You need to click the little green arrow next to the play button and then click on the Optifine profile. As you can see, it says 1.14.2 Optifine. Now, if you don't have that profile, no worries. Click the three lines up here in the top right, then click on launch options here, and then you should be able to add a new profile. Go ahead and click on that, and then you can name this whatever you want. I'm going to name it play.breakdowncraft.com. Why am I naming it that? Because that is the best 
Minecraft server in the multiverse. We have grief protected survival, two survival servers, one with this player economy, one with a server based economy with slash shop and all that stuff. It is absolutely incredible, completely grief protected. In addition to our custom Skyblock server with over 100 players online every single day, over 200 players online, the entire network, absolutely incredible. So come play with us. Play.breakdowncraft.com is the IP. Nevertheless, under where you've entered your name there, you want to click on this version drop-down box. In here, you should have release 1.14.2-Optifine, which we do right there. So go ahead and click on that. And then next to resolution, you want to go ahead and change that if you want. I'm going to. You don't have to change your resolution. I just am, so you'll be able to see in-game. Now go ahead and click Save here. And then we want to click on the News tab. Click the little green arrow next to the Play button, except this time we want to select the profile we created. In our case, play.breakdowncraft.com right there. Click on that and click Play. Now Minecraft 1.14.2 will open up with Optifine installed. It really is that quick. It really is that simple. It's going to open everything up and I'll prove to you Optifine is installed by just checking out our video settings. That's the easiest way to check in. Once we're in game, we'll be able to see the video settings and we'll be able to see that shaders are there and all of that cool stuff. So once we're here, we can click on options. We can go over to a video settings and sure enough, we do have shaders. We have animations. We can turn these all off, all on, turn specific ones off and select a shaders pack if we want to. We can do all of that right here in Optifine. So if you have any questions about Optifine for 114.2, if you have any questions about Minecraft, anything like that, let me know in the comment section down below. We check comments comments on every single video. Also, be sure to come play with us at play.breakdowncraft.com, the best Minecraft server in the multiverse. Again, grief protected survival, player economy, server economy. We've got both, whichever one you want, as well as an incredible custom Skyblock server with over 100 players online every single day. So come play with us, play.breakdowncraft.com, the best Minecraft server in the multiverse. Anyway, my name is Nick. Thank you so, so much for watching. Give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel for more awesome content every single day of the week. I am out. Peace.